hours. You show up after. I asked you. you, you I texted. It. You should have heard it on. I don't think you'll be able to get it on on camera though. Why? You won't be able to. You won't be able to. Hear oh, anything. the the exhaust is off. It's fucking loud, dude. Loud. No, no joke. Like it fucking hurts. Like your mic, the mic won't pick up. I'll start it. I tried. Alex is happy. Look, that's his happy. You face. gotta do this. No too. errors. Uh, he's happy, bro. It actually took shorter time than than we had some complications, but. Oh, you, you should have been here last night or this morning. <laughs> bro, Kurt dropped the jack, bro. He dropped the tranny on us. What the fuck? Legit, like dropped Why? it. He's a dumbass. All right, here's the shit. You ready? All right, I'm ready. It's loud. I'm just love preparing you. You might have to do this. Nah, it's not gonna be that loud. Okay. You'll see. This is not even a cold start, by the way. Sounds like a tractor. A V10 tractor. It's fucking loud, dude. Damn, it dude. works. No error codes. So, awesome. Yeah. So. Need, all you need now is the, the gear changer, and then you get to go for a drive. Yeah, wiring is all good. I literally made this harness last night, too. This one? Yeah, I made this one last night. And all I right. got it spot on. Your boy right here. So. Take care of your harness needs. <laughs> yeah, Denzel, shout out to him. He helped us or helped me put the tranny in. It was kind of a pain in the butt, to be honest, getting it to line up, but eventually we got it seated and all that. However, I think I do have a small coolant leak and it's situated in the back of the motor, so that's not going to be fun fixing, but we'll see. You can still fix, at least yeah. you know what it is. As long as you know what it is, then yeah. you can fix it. But wow. it's, it's, it runs. No error code. That was loud, dude. Yeah, fucking, we were up till about 2 in the morning. Yeah. Oh, cut this one out. Okay. Oh, he's getting comfortable. He's already comfortable. So I currently have this issue where I can lock the car when I try to open it, the driver's side and the passenger side, it opens, right? You can see it over there. It won't focus right, but, but the driver's side won't open. And last night, I was trying to open it like that, and it wasn't allowing me to either. So, uh, side of the actuator, or this this bolt lock thing that I have to change and I got like all these tools for it. Also, in last time's or yesterday's video, we installed these. Bad news, the barrel door lock thing, that mechanism is okay. But when I press the unlock button, it still doesn't pop up. So the only thing that leads me to conclude is that it's the door actuators, which is freaking expensive. Oh, uh, it's gonna suck. Hell no, I'm gonna wait till like the very last. I gotta take pictures of that. No, that's not it. Right there. Screwdrivers. Here. Pliers. Here. Hey, Porcado, come off. So you got hungry, so we're at In and Out. Yep. Well, I was on there recording this. So what, what would you say is the 31 please? 31 please. What would you say is the best brakes you've ever had in a car? 
my 240Z. The brake feel? Brake feel and brake power. Is it because it's light? Yeah. And it had fucking Wilwoods all the way around. Great, dude. That thing was great. You want to see something real sick, though? Yeah. The best thing ever. Yeah. Check this out. God damn. Bro. Did you get it? Alright, I got it. I got it. It's my turn. It's my turn. If you like this video, like the video. If you want to subscribe for more videos, you should. Also, I got a fine ass Instagram. You should go follow me there. Alex also got a pretty beast Instagram. Luis's Instagram is whack because he doesn't post no photos. It's my yearly. Goodbye.